Hey, gang, here's news, big news, a cat show. Stop your shoving and I'll read it for the little blokes. Cat with the longest tail. Best looking cat. Gee, I know where there's a bonza cat. And so every cat in South Melbourne realised that two or three of its nine lives were in peril. Got him. And off went the palpitating victim towards an entry form. Oh, big brother's in it too. This cat's been to the tin hairs. Knows the escapes too. Well, there's going to be one Tom who'll have the tiles all to himself tonight. Here he is. Oh, Bill, what a beaut. Cat burglars already. How many homes missed the contented purring of the household cat? And how many mice came out to play? What a place for the crystal set radio builder. Cat's whiskers all over the place. No, Mrs. Taint yours. Unlike some afternoon bridge players, the entrants have no illusions. They know their cats. Blue blood didn't count here. Not quality, but quantity. The lady next door will be wondering where the Persians got to. Oh, somebody's darlings. Hero of a hundred battles soothed by a woman's caressing touch. The Scotch cat on the left won the prize for the smallest cat. Its mean weight was three quarters of a pound. But the kittens didn't have a meow of protest. Their eyes weren't open to what was going on. A composite entry, Bimbo, the biggest cat in the show, and Polly, the famous talking parrot. Where's Polly? Oh, she's in the ca cage.